first of all, just let me just wait those Thanks, Sorry about that. No, yeah. Fine. Just uh, seeing McCann go down, just your heart go out to him, and how are you feeling without him in the lineup? Yeah, really unfortunate for our team. Um, wishing him all the best in his recovery. Um, obviously, he's been a huge part of our success all year, and um, now other guys are going to have to step up. Um, try to play a bigger role maybe and fill that gap so um, just really unfortunate for the team I think um, that's behind us now it's not our focus um, I think we've all been in touch with him and hoping he's feeling better but um, our focus is to start a next game and um, just getting off to a good start in their building any comments on the Kale McCarr suspension because you saw a teammate go down not really any comments I mean, the league handles it the way they handle it and um, they have their justification for everything. So, like I said, it sucks that he's out. Um, we're really going to miss him. Um, we don't want that to be a distraction in our locker room. We want to focus on the plan that's that we have in hand and um, just focus to the start of the next game. Is it is it a fine line in playoff hockey to not try to administer justice but just play your game? I mean, obviously, you see a teammate go down and you could very well take panels and stuff like that, but you guys yeah. kept your composure. Yeah, I thought we did a pretty good job. We want to play hard on all of their guys. Um, it's just a, a unique situation that we don't want to focus too much on. Um, we don't want it to be a distraction in the game. Um, I think you can kind of get chasing games when you're just trying to you know, do your own justification for things. So um, we'll play the game like we always have, hard and honest, and um, we just really need to uh, get off to the right start for game five. Is there a role for a tough guy in this league anymore, or is it, I mean, I'm not trying, not in that situation, I'm just saying it just seems like hockey's gotten away from that, and playoff hockey is very, it's a different level, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. There's, um, there's lots of different roles on teams, and I think our team has uh, a little bit of everything. I think certain guys step up when they need to. Um, no one backs down from any fight, so... Um, it's a unique quality of a team. Um, all teams are built very different, um, but I don't think um, that you need to really have a guy that's simply just in a role of enforcement. I think everyone needs to be able to play the game, and you see that throughout all the leagues. All these guys who drop the gloves maybe more than others are still phenomenal players. You did a hell of a job getting in shooting lanes last night. Has that been an emphasis, uh, something you're happy with? Yeah, shot blocks and hits, those are important parts of playoff hockey. Um, they go a long way, and they build confidence within the team. Um, shows that you're taking care of each other out there, and um, I think that just creates a good feeling um, within each other, um, just knowing that willing to sacrifice each other, um, blocking shots, it's not something that anyone wants to do, and I think, especially on the penalty kill, we've done a pretty good job of getting in lanes and um, on breakdowns and things like that. We've done a good job of giving ourselves up. What did you see in the penalty kill, people stepping up in that position when McCann went out? Yeah, I think everyone's rotated throughout the penalty kill. We've had a lot of different units out there. Um, I think when you're seeing the same thing or the same team over and over again, you start to catch on to their tendencies, but um, by no means do we want to be relaxed and satisfied. I think um, we need to roll with our confidence right now and understand that um, they're also trying to change things and adapt to our penalty kill. So um, we know they have lots of threats out there, and they're very skilled. And um, I just think everyone's been pretty composed for the most part. And like I said, blocking shots and, and things like that, doing what we have to do to be able to kill those two minutes. Do you think uh, Everly just, I mean, it was a shot, and then Everly was in the right spot at the right time. Do you think players earn their puck luck? Do you believe in puck luck? Yeah, I think it's a little bit of both. I mean, some plays it's like, wow, I can't believe the puck's there. But I think... Um, on the other side of things, guys put themselves in good positions to get the puck. So um, I just think, especially on a power play, you're just trying to shoot shoot the puck when the, the lane is there. Um, like I said, we've done a good job blocking shots on our <clears throat> on our penalty kill, and they've done a good job too. So um, just to get second chances, that's really huge on five on five and in, uh, on the power play. So um, I just think that. He's a very smart player. He knows where the puck has a tendency to bounce, and he was in the right spot at the right time. 52 hits, franchise high. How are you guys feeling? Yeah. <laughs> I, we should be feeling good about that. I think we maybe got a 
away from that a little bit in the previous games. I think game one we, we did a pretty good job, but um, I just think that that creates momentum and um, I think that creates more space for us to make plays. Um, not that we want to be running around, but um, I think when we're that physical, we're getting in the way of their guys and slowing them down. And I think um, having a team like that who uses their speed to their strengths, um, I think that's something that we want to continue to do. Just, just overall, just describe the opportunity, the confidence that you guys have right now. I mean, you've outplayed them for big stretches, right? Yeah, we should be feeling good. Um, facing the former champions, um, there's no reason why we can't go out there and put our best foot forward and um, believe in ourselves. We've done a great job all series so far. Um, it's 0-0 now, um, so it's going to be the best of three, and um, I think we're all looking forward to that. Um, you know, it's it's a stressful time of the year, but I think um, in that we've built a lot of confidence, and I think everyone's feeling really good about their individual games right now. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you.